Some Terre Haute residents have reached out to our station about propaganda being thrown into their front yards. Lily Pezzavento has been following this story and meeting with neighbors. Lily, what do these people find? Well, Mike, residents have reported white supremacist propaganda being thrown into their yards by people in a white van. And now local social justice groups are getting involved. A homeowner on Center Street who wishes to remain anonymous claims white supremacist flyers were thrown into his and other neighbors' yards over the weekend. Like the one that actually was on my yard right there was just a big SWAT sticker that said, white power, get some. The homeowner contacted the civil justice group Wabash Valley in solidarity. I got the news when I was sitting in conversation with two other Interfaith Council of the Wabash Valley members. I'm also a member of the Interfaith Council of the Wabash Valley. I was sitting with a Muslim woman and a Jewish woman and myself. So the three of us sitting there having good conversation and then to learn that there were these hateful, anti-Semitic, white supremacist flyers being distributed. In response to these materials, the justice group will hold a vigil in partnership with the Terre Haute NAACP and other organizations. No one is born bad or evil. It is a learned response. So the people who is doing this are people who have been lost within the community and they're looking for people who are also lost. Terre Haute police responded to calls from homeowners, but because nothing was damaged and no laws were broken, no report was filed. This homeowner says he doesn't feel threatened, he just worries about possible escalation. And it was definitely recruitment, it definitely wasn't any kind of get out of our neighborhood, but they definitely feel like they're on the rise. And you know, the way that the world is right now, when they get accused or they get complimented as being very fine people by people on television, that, that emboldens them, that, that it's okay to, you know, express hate. Wednesday's vigil will be held at the Vigo County Courthouse at 5 p.m., where city justice officials will be speaking out on these events. Well, I'm curious, has propaganda been spotted anywhere else? Well, Mike, it's also been seen in Paris, Illinois, where residents have called in reports to the Paris Police Department. All right, thank you, Lily.